Welcome to the School of English Communication and Philosophy. My name is Professor Damien Walford Davis and I'm currently head of school. My name's Olivia and I've come to the Masters as a mature student, having finished my undergraduate degree a long ten years ago. This Masters has been really important for me in terms of professional development and in satiating my intellectual curiosity really. My name is Arthur and I'm currently studying on the MA in English Literature at Cardiff University. One of the best things about Cardiff University's literature programme at both BA and MA is the research driven teaching that occurs so that our academics are at the very cutting edge of their particular fields which obviously then feeds into our teaching and own research. You'll be taught and supervised by discipline defining critics in your several fields. In the recent 2014 Research Excellence Framework English language and literature achieved a top 10 place, which we're very proud of, while philosophy achieved the fourth position nationally for the impact of their research on life and society outside the academy. I would recommend undergrad students who are considering doing their masters here in Cardiff to actually go ahead with it because while I was doing it here, it's actually helped me gain confidence in terms of presentation skills I've managed to take part in conferences and I've managed to speak in front of academic staff and I've also gained valuable research skills which will in no doubt help me in the future. Yeah, one of the things I, I really like about philosophy is the way that the discussion takes place in such small groups. The learning takes place in a social context, in a, in a dialogue, in a dialectic, rather than when you're just doing the reading. Because they're such small groups, you get to know everyone quite well, which is interesting for when you're writing your own essays because you can kind of use their opinions to apply to your own knowledge. And it's then useful when you're then applying it outside of academic philosophy as well in a sort of in a business context if you know how to manage someone else's argument and opinions and how to integrate that into, into your developing ideas that's very useful in any context. I decided to stay on and do my PhD after my MA in English Literature here because I really felt like I was a part of a vibrant research community even as a postgraduate taught student. We've got a lot of fantastic resources at Cardiff University and one of them is the Cardiff Special Collections and Archives, where we are today. And this contains a lot of old texts from across the ages that we can all use to help our own research. It's just been an amazing course and the staff are absolutely amazing and very encouraging. As far as the size and shape of the school is concerned, we're a school of around 60 academics plus a cohort of dedicated professional services staff where up to around 200 postgraduate students currently and what that size enables is not only personalized support but also on the other end of the scale the heft to enable things to happen. One of the great things about the MA at Cardiff is the open mic nights which happen every three weeks or so. They're a great opportunity to read your work to a fresh audience at first is a terrifying prospect because you're getting up and you're standing in front of the people on your course and a handful of strangers. Again, because you know the people on your course, you get into that very quickly and it's very liberating to be able to share your work. Hi, my name is Ellie and I am doing my MA at Cardiff. I did my BA at Cardiff as well. And after experiencing the lecturers and how encouraging and interactive they were with the students, I wanted to stay on. I chose to do ethics and social philosophy because I want to work in a charity sector and the skills are going to be really useful when I apply to a job. We run seminar programmes where visiting speakers from across the nation and indeed sometimes internationally come and deliver their own research which is at the very top of the field so we are always exposed to the very latest research here at Cardiff. I chose to study my PhD here because I'd done my undergrad here and I fell in love with the city and I wasn't ready to leave yet. There's a lot of history here, there's a, there's a wonderful castle, there's a great museum and the Bay Area is, is fantastic, especially in the summertime. I'm David, I'm currently doing a Master's in Forensic Linguistics. Uh, it's been great to be an international student here uh, in the centre so far, everybody's been super welcoming, really helping me adjust to life in Cardiff, in Wales, you know, outside of the United States more generally. So I'm Lauren and in 2014 I completed my MA in Applied Linguistics and I'm now currently doing a PhD in Language and Communication within the Centre here in Cardiff. I've really enjoyed my experience here at Cardiff University. 
I find that it's a really supportive environment and it's made up of people from all over the world which is a really great way to learn about others and to increase your knowledge. I particularly enjoyed the MA because I found it was a really good balance between teaching and independent study. Uh, the teaching was carried out in seminar groups of 15 to 20 people and I found this a really great size where everybody had a point of view that they could share and this point of view was welcomed. The Masters has been very supportive. The staff here have been fantastic in helping me as a mature student integrate with the majoritively younger students here. It's a really welcoming and warm environment. I can't recommend Cardiff highly enough without the support of the staff here who really are willing to go above and beyond uh, their remit to support students. I don't think I'd be where I am today.